quick. Take a guess on how many colors we are going to dye this egg. And we've already done the outlines in white and light green. Into a bright, cheerful yellow first, and then a slightly darker shade. It looks subtle now, but it'll make a difference later. I love this vibrant orange. And of course, I need a passionate red. Now, we are going to have to wash off all those warm tones so we can get a clear palette for the cool side of the spectrum. I'm going to start here with a dark green to fill in all the leaf details, and then a sweet baby blue which will give a strong contrast to a rich, deep, dark blue. I love to layer my blues. And now a bold and confident purple. Finally, black is the color that represents the darkness just before dawn breaks. Now, I know you think it looks fascinating now, but you have to see it when the wax melts off. 